Now the fourth way of composing synchronous functions is using the stage, I believe it's stage one, at the time of this video anyway, pipeline operator. In Babel 7, they have three different ways of using it. Only two are implemented at the time of this writing. But if you Google Babel pipeline operator, they'll have a nice little blog post. You can install the plugin here. But this blog post, although it's written in July, has really good comparisons of the three different ways of doing it. And the biggest drama right now is async await. How do you handle asynchronous when you're doing this outside of a language that doesn't really have that like Elm or handles it really nicely like F sharp. So we're going to talk about minimal and the smart way of doing things. I'm not going to really cover this right now because the async is still in flux and this video is really just focusing on sync. But I highly encourage you to check out this blog post. It really gives you a good understanding of what the pipeline is all about.